What's going on everybody and welcome back to another episode of F1 2020. We are back here with round five of our season two uh, my team career. We're at the Netherlands, the Dutch Grand Prix. Once again, very excited for this. It's just a fun track to drive. I'm relatively fast on it in comparison to some of the other um, circuits. So we'll see what we can get done. I know some people wanted me to up the difficulty after last episode. How about if we, the next race we win, if we win the race, we will up the difficulty. I damn near had that race won, um, but uh, you know, ended up spinning out in the last, uh, last, last lap, last couple of laps. So I'll go ahead and run you guys through the setup. Um, in our season one, the, the setups in that video as well. But, um, how do I fucking look at it? R3. There we go. So aerodynamics four and six transmission, 50% on throttle, 75% off, uh, negative three, negative 1.5, 0 0.05, 0 0.2 on the geometry. Suspension is one, two, three. Nine three five, a lot of curbs um, that you're hitting, so relatively soft suspension, 100% brake pressure, 50% front brake bias, and then we just leave the tire pressure um, the same. So that was the best setup that I could find online. I did a few practice rounds, and killing it in practice, we were um, fucking supposed to qualify first, projected to qualify first. So we'll see, uh, <clears throat> we'll see if we can actually do that today here we go about to hit the track it's race weekend when am i posting this sunday shit the race is probably over but i don't know who won yet okay <clears throat> try not to get anybody's way this um oh can we slow down and i'm gonna turn that down there we go engine was kind of loud <clears throat> This track's just fun to drive because there's so much traffic and so much stuff going on. We're probably going to wreck, but it's all good. It is what it is. <clears throat> um, okay. Whoops. Try to warm the tires up a little bit on our outlap here. I feel like maybe that's up to temp. I don't know. Should be. Fiat with the fastest lap. Yo, my bad, fool. Oh, oh, shit. That was my fault. That was my fault. I got yelled at. <laughs> Yo, he was pissed. That just fucked his lap up. <clears throat> my bad. That shit does happen, though. I was trying to get out of the way. I just... I was on the wrong part of the track. Can I just... Sit here and... There we go. Let Magnuson go through. All right, here we go. Let's see what we can do qualifying. His fastest lap is a 111.7. I put up a faster lap than that in practice, so we'll see if we can do it once again. Here we go, baby. Please get out of my way. God, Magnuson is gonna fuck us up. Oh, thank you, brother. slow through that part. Might have to get a redo. It's kind of slow through the end there too. Gotta beat a 111.7. Oh! 110? Damn! Oh, we might fuck around and win the race, boys. Can I, uh, can I just return to the garage? I don't feel like driving around for a whole nother lap. Okay, let's see if that's good. I think that might be good. Maybe we do gotta up the difficulty, I don't know. Um, our car's getting better, but it's still not like the best car on the track, obviously, so 
We probably shouldn't be winning races. Um, but I need to win a couple races. You know what I mean? Just for the hell of it. We're not that much faster. What, three tenths? Or is that three hundredths of a second? No, that's three tenths. Hey, I'll take that. That's pole position at the Dutch Grand Prix, baby. Oh, shit. Oh. On um, pole. On um, pole. Okay. I'll take it. Um, Qualifying complete. Let's shit. Um, now I'm nervous. Okay. So we're leading Verstappen and Bottas behind us. Albon, Lewis Hamilton in six. Damn. Okay. I guess this is it. Let's hop right into the race. Here we go. Let's win us a race, boys. Uh. Don't ram me. All right. What the fuck? I hate when this happens. Right in a turn, too? Come on. What the fuck? What? Oh, what the... Now they don't let him catch me. It's all good. Trying to sabotage us. Not worried about it. The sector two, I'm not great at. That's a decent start. Good job. Almost went into the fucking wall. Just gotta calm down a little bit. Just drive my drive. Just drive my drive, that's all it is. Don't worry about anybody else. Fuck that part up. Now Verstappen smells blood. Not doing too hot. Finally, damn. Got a purple sector one, I'll take that. That turn right there, I'm just trash at. I give back so much time. I do great in sector one and then just give it all back. Damn. I'm not going to win the race taking the second half of the track like that.
Why is Verstappen so much faster than everyone else? What the fuck? Ah. Fuel target is plus one. Faster engine modes are available. Get on it, go. Holy shit. This man's not fucking around. I mean, Verstappen and I are just running off and leaving everybody else. But I gotta put some distance between myself and him. It's just all this sector two, man. Specifically this turn and this one especially. It's got a pretty wide exit, so I guess I can get on the gas a little bit quicker, but but That's just that's where he makes up all his time on me. Fucking engine is going to be down slightly. It's showing some minor wear. Some minor wear? I was not made aware of this before the race. I'm trying to be careful on that corner there too because it's so easy to overshoot that exit and end up in the fucking rocks. Fastest lap of the race, okay. Almost got a second between Verstappen and I. I'm wondering if I should take more curb on that turn. He just gained so much time on me, man. There's gotta be a better angle of attack. That I can take on that. <clears throat> Box on this lap, here we go. Hi. I'm speeding, boys.
This full of Verstappen is a maniac. How is he this much faster than the rest of the field? Is it just because he's staying in DRS range? Like you telling me if I could just break free of him? We'd be good? I don't even know. <clears throat> Verstappen's pitting behind us. No mistakes. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Two seconds and we're out. Oh, Jesus. Now we're hitting traffic. Oh, Jesus. All right, here we go. Yes, Verstappen's way back. This might be good for us. If it can help put some distance between him and I. Well, these guys don't take that part very fast, but Verstappen's a fucking animal. Whoops. Forgot I have strict corner cutting on. I was about to say, can y'all pit, please? How much time? Oh, Verstappen's in like fourth now. Let's go. <laughs> Nick is coming in for his stomp. Oh, we got super lucky. We need to push right now. Put as much distance as we can between him and I. Oh, shit. Another purple sector one. I think it's like how wide the exits on these are. You can actually get on the gas pretty early in that turn. That turn, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Let's go! Alright, Norris and Ocon are probably gonna pit. Yeah, they did. Alright, four seconds. In between Verstappen and I. Uh, if he comes back and beats me, I'm just trash. Because now he doesn't have DRS to keep up with us on the straights. Okay, we're looking good. Purple Sector 3, okay. The car behind is dropping back. We're seeing a gap form. Well, let's go. That's what we want. Yeah, we're definitely going to have to up the... difficulty after this. We're gonna throw that bitch on 90. Imagine I start racing the 110 AI. Ooh. Damn. 
Damn, my audio just bugged out. You heard that? Yeah, almost six seconds. Holy. Might be my best performance yet. Don't let me speak too soon, though. We all know what happened last race. Yeah, I think I need to enter that turn wider. That way I can get on the gas quicker on the exit. But if you go too wide, then you're in the fucking rocks over there. Easier to get in the rocks on that part, too. Let's go! Five more laps! Really trying to be better about the whole fuel situation. So like if I stay wide, 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 and then I gotta like fucking dive into that fucking apex and be on the gas. Oh, I don't know. I'd have to sit here and like practice this track for like a fucking hour. I probably will end up doing that too since I'm a psycho. <clears throat> Seven and a half second lead. I'm about to start a lap, I'm fools. Like, that felt a little bit better. I was on the gas a lot quicker. That turn, I just, I don't take enough curb. I got all that curb there to hit. And I don't think I've touched it one time. I gotta remember the curbs are my friend. Still putting time in between us and Verstappen, though, so I feel good about that. See if we can take some curb here. Whoops, I short shifted. I touched it. 
<laughs> On purpose, I didn't even have to. Like right there, I'm just always afraid I'm gonna wreck into the wall. I think because the other day I was racing this track online, literally it was a short qualifying and a 18 lap race. I was P3 for most of the race. On the final lap, I crashed into that fucking Rolex wall. Retired the car, like crash, crash. Trying to hit that curb. And ended up coming in like fucking last and it was just heartbreaking. Oh, tell me we're gonna finish under a safety car. Damn, who was that? Somebody was fucked up. Let me focus. Okay, clear. That's probably how much curb I should be taking, but at like full speed. Yeah, right here, I just fucking terminal damage crashed into the fucking wall. One more lap. All I gotta do is not wreck. I'm not even worrying about the fuel, fuck all that. I am gonna put some ERS on though. Just take it nice and easy through here. Take no chances. No chances at all. Just a nice, smooth finish. There we go, just make sure I avoid the rocks. And the wall coming out of the final turn. We did it, boys! Let's go! That was our first win in so long. Why is my face so dark? Damn. Can you see me? Yeah, you can. Yes! Yes! Winner! How are we not driving? Well, I guess we started in P1 and we won. Okay. So I said at the start of the video, if we won, we were going to up the difficulty. Got to do it now. Got to be done. And talk to me. What do you think it was that sealed the win for them? I think that your baby? time management on track and very smooth driving definitely assisted in their victory today. No, it was definitely the, the, the pit that situation. Race, that saved us. Verstappen got caught in traffic and then he couldn't use so that DRS to keep up with me. Drivers. Absolutely fantastic race. That was fun. Not a whole lot of uh, action, but I was going real fast. Let's have yours. So that was cool. That I feel great. The aero department. Hmm. They're nice. What do you think made the difference between this weekend and last weekend? Power unit. Power unit aerodynamics. That's all I'm trying to get. Passing all expectations. Can anything or anyone stop you? With this aero package? I don't think so. Do you feel that your teammate put on a good show for the home crowd? Uh huh. Yeah, yeah, I, no comment. Sorry, Nick. Appreciate Neither of those seemed like good answers, I don't know. Okay. Leclerc, I think we might have finally just beaten him in terms of a rival. It's going to make me pick a hard-ass rival, and then I'm going to up the difficulty, and I'm never going to beat him. I'm only going up five increments at a time. I think one increment at a time is like a tenth of a second on a lap. So this would make them half a second faster. Which would be pretty damn fast. Um, just because... Like, I won that race, but I'm I'm just pretty fast in that 
circuit in comparison to others. All right, let's look at the R&D tree. Let's develop this. I'm kind of tired of going after durability stuff. Like, it's important, but... Yeah, give me that... Give me that powertrain. Yeah. Yeah. When will it be done? Oh, look at our car. Wow. Almost as fast as Renault, McLaren, Ferrari. Wow. Okay. Develop that. I have 12 resource points left. It said our, um... Something was wearing out on the car. thought it said the engine. We might have, like, one more race left. Before we need to, uh... To switch that out. Yeah, we'll give it at least... At least one more race. Okay, there we go, though. We got $9.5 million in the bank. The Spanish Grand Prix is where we will be racing next. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Oh, I guess I'll just... Where's the... Let's go preferences. Um, gameplay settings. AI. I thought we were on 85. I guess we are on 80. 90 is master. Should we go to master? No, we're going to go 85 expert. And then once we get a um, fast car, then we will... Uh, then we'll put it on 90. Strict corner cutting stringency. Yeah. I like that. Okay, everybody. That's going to do it for this episode of F1 2020. Thank you all so much for tuning in. I will catch you right back here next time. If you did enjoy the video, be sure to leave a like. If you didn't, just refresh it and give it one more chance. And as always, guys, I don't really have a